Guys, listen, I play a lot of Madden, and I consider myself to be pretty pretty good at it, all right? I play in TD Barrett's leagues, I play in TSAP's money leagues, but I've never actually played in the money league with high stakes, with a lot of money on the line, with half the team having abilities, but that ends today, all right? I joined the lobby up uh, fantasy draft in this, the newest league. I, don't, I think that's what it's called, lobby up. Either way, man, I joined. We actually got pick number one. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even gonna keep it a secret. I probably put it in the thumbnail, the title, everywhere on the screen. We got pick number one. Let's go ahead and hop into the video. Hop into the draft, man. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. We got pick one. We got pick one. We got pick one. Lamar me. Lamar me. Lamar me. Where is he? Where is he? Where? Oh. Yo, I wasn't. Th where, 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 where? Oh, Lamar Jackson, welcome to the team, baby. Pick one, let's go. Lamar, welcome to the squad. Lamar me, Lamar me, Lamar me. Lamar me, I got sent to the chat, boys. Lamar me, let's go, man. Lamar me, I got sent to the chat, boys. Lamar me, let's go. All right, boys, listen, I'm sorry. I have to send to the chat real quick. Uh, we got Lamar Jackson. I, I, that's a no-brainer to me. It's Lamar Jackson and Madden. I mean, everybody does get a free superstar X-Factor quarterback, but it's Lamar, it's Lamar Jackson, bro. I got to take him when he's available. I could have gone like Tyreek Hill, like somebody picked four does, because, again, you do get a free X-Factor quarterback. I don't care about none of that, bro. I'm taking Lamar Jackson. I'm taking the best quarterback in the National Football League. I'm taking my guy, number eight. Let's go, man. I'll see you guys round two. All right, guys, my pick is actually coming up here pretty quickly, about five picks, and I have back-to-back, -back, can't forget about that. Um, I've been trying to scout out who I should take, and I'm kind of looking at Brandon Ayuk. He is a superstar. I actually haven't used him since he became a superstar, so I feel like that would be a cool one. I think I'm going to take him if he's still available. I see Zay Flowers. Can't, it, it, way too early for Zay, but I see him. All right, just know I see him. Um, and then I also saw my boy Kyle Hamilton still available, so... I think those are going to be my two picks right there. Kyle Hamilton and also Brandon Ayuk. <coughs> Excuse me, because again, we have back-to-back -back picks. Again, that's just... All right, well, Brandon Ayuk just got taken. Unfortunate. I'll take Debo if he's available. I mean, Cooper Cup is here. Debo is a little bit faster. Should still be superstar. X-Factor, even better. It's only a one-year league. I don't know if I mentioned that already. Um, but... I like this pick a lot. People are taking the, all the DBs are going, man. I'm expecting my games, my people I'm playing against, to just have so many KOs all over the field. That's fine with me, man. I think we're gonna start. Save the course. Go Debo if he's available, and just just ball out, man. DJ Moore is here. I wouldn't hate DJ Moore actually. DJ Moore actually might be a little bit of a better pick than Debo Sammy. I don't think I've had DJ Moore before. Good player. Seems like a great guy in real life, if that matters. I, it, it doesn't, but I just thought I would mention it. Um, I kind of like that pick instead. I might go him. Calvin Austin, Nicole Hartman, Rashid Shahid. All studs in their own right, but you know, probably too early to be taking any of them. I really like Kyle Hamilton. I'm definitely taking Kyle Hamilton if he's still there. All right, man. Fred Warner gets taken there. That's actually not the worst pick in the world. I'm going to go I'm gonna go wide receiver. Okay, I'm going to take DJ Moore. I think. Uh, yeah, I'm going to take DJ Moore. No, I saw Chris Jones available, man. Let's go with Chris Jones. I know I, I flip-flopped, guys, but I saw Chris Jones, like, last second. I'm going to take Chris Jones. Like, one of the best players in the NFL, to be honest with you. And then round three, I want to take Kyle Hamilton so bad, but I don't think I can justify it in my head. So we're going to go wide receiver, and we're going to take DJ Moore here. I want to, dude, I want to take... Kyle Hamilton so bad, but I, but I feel like DJ Moore is a smarter pick. So, so far our team is looking like Lamar, DJ Moore, and then also Chris Jones. And I actually really like that top three right there. Um, I'll see you guys round four, pick third too. So coming up on our fourth pick here, and I had three people in mind, and they all just went in like rapid succession, man. Uh, Cameron Hayward's here. I don't know how I feel about him. He's, he's an option, right? He's an option. Um, I was thinking maybe Talanoa Hufunga. We put an X Factor on him. I was hoping we can get like another superstar though, so I don't have to use another superstar. Um, but there's nobody. Oh, Brian Burns is here, so. Alright. 
fingers crossed, man. All right. Fingers crossed. Brian Burns is still there after this pick, man. All right. He goes Ringo Bingo. Interesting pick right there. I'm going to go. Yeah, I'm definitely going Brian Burns. If we can find it. Oh, Trent McDuffie's there. All right. We're going to get Trent McDuffie, I think. Oh, I lost him. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh my gosh. Nah, he's here for sure. Okay, there he is. I think they go Trevor McDuffie. He is a little shorter, which is probably why he's still on the board. But, I mean, pretty good overall. I think he can really ball out, man. I need to build up the DB because I actually haven't taken any just yet. Taking a quick look to see who's left. I'm, yeah. Devon Witherspoon, that's a little bit later. I feel like Marcus Williams is here. Uh, Hufunga's here. I feel like Hufunga might be the pick. But we really need DB. We need to really need corner. We really need corner. I'm gonna go turn the top again. 5'11. I could work with it. Sorry to have hope for a breakout game. I don't hate that pick right there. Let me know what you guys think about those two back-to-back -back picks. A little iffy on those. Alright guys, round six is here. We're on pick about 28. Um honestly, I don't even know what direction to go in right now. Um I could go wide receiver, but I don't think we really need to prioritize that right now. We'll get that maybe next round. Not next round, but, you know, the next set of picks. Um, I could really use a corner, and there aren't too many good ones available, unfortunately, man. I mean, I don't even know who I would go with. Maybe I do. Show me star. Oh, this is the pick 100%. Joey Porter Jr. having a pretty decent season in real life, man. Uh, rookie season. Probably the, probably the third best rookie corner right now. Christian Gonzalez was number one, I would say, until he got hurt earlier in the season. Um, that boy, Devin Witherspoon in Seattle, crazy. But again, Joey Porter Jr. is having himself a season, boys. He definitely, definitely is. So he's going to be the pick if he's still available uh, when it's my turn to pick. Uh, so I think he's going to be the pick. And then after him, I think we go with safety. Oh, CJ Anderson's there as well. Marcus Williams, you guys know I love Marcus Williams in Madden. He plays super, super well for me every single time I get him. So he would be a good pick. Jalen Petrie is here, but it might be a little too early for Jalen Petrie. Adam's fall from Madden Grace is crazy. 84 overall, he used to be like a 92 overall superstar. Crazy. Grant Delpit is here, who is actually really solid. So that was Brian Branch. Um, all right, I'm going to pick Joey Porter Jr. I'm fingers crossed that he's still here. If he's gone, guys, I'm going to be in absolute shambles. There he is right here. Luckily, he's still here. Let's go ahead and take Joey Porter Jr. I like that pick right there. And let's double back, I think, on DB. And I think we take Marcus Williams. Uh, and I, a little bit slower, but he has a better overall than some of these other faster safeties. Um, Tyron Matthews still here, but he's a little bit shorter. He's about four inches shorter. Yeah, I like the pick there. I'm going to go Marcus Williams. All right, let me show you guys the team so far. I think it's taken shape pretty nicely. I've gone heavy defense since starting off with two offensive players, or maybe I got Christian on second, but Lamar, DJ Moore, offensive players. Beautiful. Defensive players, Chris Jones, Brian Burns, Trent McDuffie, and then Joey Porter Jr. We probably put the optional X factor on, I don't even know, maybe Joey Porter, I would say over Trent McDuffie and just hope Trent McDuffie gets a breakout. I don't hate this team so far. We're gonna need a wide receiver two, and then we're also just gonna need more DBs. We only have, what, one, two, three so far. We probably need like five, six. Um, so yeah, next couple picks, we'll probably pick two more DBs, uh, maybe a wide receiver. The last couple picks I'm gonna make here are coming up, and I feel like I gotta pick DB. We have three total DBs so far. Gonna need a couple more, honestly. JOK is here. Kind of, a, kind of a tempting pick, honestly. You can play him at like sub linebacker. Has his zone coverage. 78 zone. It's not bad. Uh, I don't think I will. No, I probably won't. Probably shouldn't, but not a bad pick right there. Um, I was taking a look at the safeties. I don't really love anybody who's still available. Grant Delpit, though, is here. He's 6'3, 88 speed. Not Jimmy Ward. Uh, Grant Delpit, I'll probably be one of my picks. Brian Branch is also here. 83, 81 overall. 
I mean, they're a little bit slower. That's the, the only thing I'm a little bit concerned with, but they do both have good height. I could put both of them at sub linebacker and just kind of kind of ball out from there. So that might be a go-to. Um, hmm. Maybe wide receiver. Who's up? Who's up? Jordan Addison is here. Oh, Jordan Addison is here. I haven't used him in Madden. Oh, uh, that's a good pick. That's a good pick. Tank Dell is here, a little bit smaller. No, the same, same size. Yeah, about the same size. I'm gonna go Tank Dell. I haven't used Tank Dell in Madden. Let's go ahead and use him, man. Grab him right here. And then I'm gonna double back here and I'm gonna pick up um, Grant Delpit. So again, guys, these guys, hold on, let me get Grant Delpit before I start talking here. Let's get Grant right here. All right, so these guys are drafting 22 rounds. I, I don't have the capacity to draft 22 rounds, so I'm gonna let the CPU handle the press for me, hopefully pick up some studs, um, and I'll see you guys in, I guess, week one. All right, guys, I actually, last time you guys saw me, I was in the draft. Now we're out of the draft, showing you guys the full team lineup right here. And so far, what I'm seeing, I'm liking it. Okay, first of all, O-line, I mean, CPU did us okay. Not a bad one whatsoever, man. We could definitely work with this. Tight end, Gerald Everett. I, I think he's a little bit slower, a little bit older. 84 speed, 92 cash, and we could definitely work with that. Okay, doable. Our number one overall pick, Lamar Jackson. A few people in the chat were clowning me for picking Lamar when you can just get a free X-Factor quarterback. If you have the chance to pick Lamar Jackson, you take Lamar Jackson. I don't care, I don't care. I just don't care, all right? I'm 100% happy with that pick right there. Um, the running back, J.K. Dobbins, Tajay Spears. J.K. Dobbins is gonna be my starting running back. You guys know, Raven, Raven Faithful right here. Gonna get my guy up there. Um, wide receiver, so I'm liking what I'm seeing. DJ Moore, Kadarius Tony, and then Tank Dell. I honestly like that one, two, three combo. We have Dante Pettis as well, Isaiah Ford. Definitely good work with his offense, like the offense a lot. Going to the defensive side of football, um okay all right we got jermaine johnson uh george colophidis chris jones on the d-line okay brian burns as well on the d-line obviously i'm gonna say marcus williams grant delpit up top joey porter jr rocky sin in our slot corner cam dantzler and then trevin duffy this is honestly it's not a bad wide or cornerback room i should say trent mcduffy He's probably better in the slot, but we'll probably play him on the outside just because his high overall. Uh, Joy Porter, I might use my X Factor on, to be honest with you, and then hope Trump definitely gets a breakout. And then everybody else, man, we're just throwing a couple of these guys in the slot. Cameron Dantzler, Rocky Sin, throw them in the slot. And we're just balling out, man. Honestly, I don't, I don't hate this room at all. It's not bad whatsoever. Uh, looking at safeties, looking at my user. Uh, Marcus Williams could be up top, free safety. Grant Delpit. A little bit slower, but I, I think we can play him up top. And then sub linebacker. We got Quay Walker, but he's a little bit slower. I mean, he's not even that slow. He's a middle linebacker, so I probably shouldn't um, use him. But I got to take a look. I might be able to move him to safety. I got to check the rules. But I'm going to check the rules, see if I can move him to safety. If I can, I will. Um, besides him, though, we do have Adrian Colbert. We can play at sub linebacker. So. That's not that bad. All right, it's not that bad whatsoever, man. I'm gonna go ahead and set my depth chart and I'll see you guys week one. All right, guys, quick pause in the video because I realized I didn't explain like any of the rules to you guys. I just kind of hopped into the gameplay, hopped into the draft and whatnot. So this is a little bit different than TSAP subscriber league. So I'm gonna go ahead and explain the rules to you guys real quick. They should be on the screen, hopefully here next to me, probably this way, um, but it's an Xbox league, 48 hour advances. It's one season fancy draft. There's also an ability shop, which I'll show you guys in a second. Um, no custom playbook, no certain abilities, as you guys see on the screen here. Onsiding can only be done in the second half if you're losing the game. Um, no fourth down rules. All trades must be approved. A lot of stuff here, right? So that's that's the rules for the most part. Uh, but then let's go to the ability shop. So basically, as you can see here, all teams get in 90 overall X-Factor quarterback. Um, and if you draft an X-Factor quarterback, 90 overall, you get a free X-Factor. So you'll see on my team, I have Joey Porter Jr. as an X-Factor. You probably go, did you buy him? No, because I draft Lamar, I get 
Joey Porter X Factor for free. So that's the explanation right there. Um, you can see the other breakdowns of like other stuff you can buy. Again, I haven't spent any money in the item shop just yet. Um, if you want me to buy some abilities, let me, first of all, if you want me to buy some abilities, make sure you leave a like on the video. All right, stop playing with me. But if you want me to, you know, spend any money, let me know what you guys think I should spend it on. Um, it'd probably be like an X Factor, right? Or a Superstar, it doesn't really matter. You can get two, right? I'd probably spend it on my DBs because my DBs are trash, as you'll see here in the next couple games. Um, but just want to give you guys some context. Hop back into the video and get to the first game. Um, I don't think I'll have video week one. I think my uh, storage drive, whatever, got filled up super quick and I actually lost the footage from game one. But we got blown out 42 to 24. Man. But hop into the second game, playing the Jazz user. Let's go. On first and 10, Dugan. Right Alright guys, we played like a quarter and then the guy disconnected and we were just like we just restarting, that's what I'm trying to say here. He's running the same cross and I don't know if I can stop like two slants in the street. connect and try to pick up another first down. Oh, what the hell is happening? Man? Back to throw again. Over the middle, it's good tackle. I guess, bro. I'm just so bad. I can't stop. I can't stop anything. They'll look to throw again. I literally can't stop anything, bro. I don't even. I don't even know what's going on. On first and ten, it's Jackson. Butt naked, and go off for the races. Come on, kid, don't get caught. Don't get caught. Don't get caught. Dang, let's go, man. Touchdown, easy money. He's gonna run spinner for his band every play of the game. That's fine with me. The Jacksonville offense set to begin their next drive. A long drive last time out for this offense, Charles. If you remember, they started basically in the shadows. Oh, man. A lot of that was about throwing that football. Duggan. Scream, scream, burn, burn. Taken for it on fourth. They're indeed oh going for it as they oh look gosh, to I'm throw. Scared. Oh He's gosh, I'm going deep for Brown. Oh god, I was nervous, boys. I was nervous. All right, come on. And now possession will go over inside the 15 yard line. All right, man. Easy money, 14 to eight. I think this guy made it so great a little too early. Come on, man. Responds. Remember the last time they were out, they went for it on fourth down, did not get it, and that led to a touchdown on the other side. Fortunately, so it didn't work out for them. Here's Duggan to throw. Over the it's literally play. just the same play. I love this. Duggan now to throw. Mm, short. Yeah, They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Mm. And that's going to be caught the field. I kind of field. played that stupid. Right he's right. going to get him. It'll be second down. Back to throw. Dugan. This will be caught once again. I don't even. I, it's so and weird. Taken down at the 20 after a game on third down. This is now the ninth play of the drive. He finds his man complete. That's Brown. This is so weird, bro. It's, it's the same play. Operating from the gun. So Dugan. <laughs> to the goal line, but it's in line. Operating from the gun. Dude, I don't even. I don't know, man. I feel like he just throwing me the ball and just. My guys aren't catching me. Come on, man. Now this offense hoping to avoid the 0-2 start. Now they trail, but they've got a first and 10 here. Now it's Jackson. He'll fire deep, looking for more. I've had enough of your garbage. That's a good job right there. I had to make sure I possession caught it. I free formed it like all the way to the left and that player right there. Now Jackson. He's hoping again. Thank you, DJ. Come on, good job. 
enjoying this to see all these points go up on the board. As a former defender, you know I'm not enjoying this at all. But right now, both these teams just trading haymakers. Let's see if oh anyone gosh. slips up first. Duggan looking to throw. It's Did you guys see my guy just fall down on that play? Hollywood is random. Hollywood is going crazy. On first down, Duggan. Wow. The second I go to cover two, that's what I'm like, hey, that's a good job, by the way. Throwing, Duggan. Too bad, man. I just have 85 speed users, so. Throwing now, Jackson on first down. Hey, I try to go possession catch that so they can get knocked out. I don't have nothing to do with his general, man. That's a nice first down right there. Got to win on the run this game because he has so many abilities in the uh, secondary, but only one up top. Alright, there it is. Um, I was like, I'm just going to score. I, I feel like we can get a stop for, uh, for us to score. Right Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. With this slim deficit closing in on the end of the first half, we'll see if they can move this at least into field goal range and try to get three out of Had a 15 yard hook throw right Jackson there, bro. The second of timeouts as they stop it here with just under 40 ticks to go in this first half. There goes a deep a ball in zone. Nah, of course and not. Of the course ball not. Away it... Again, he'll drop the throw. That's fine, Tapu. Go down to like 15 seconds. No, sir. Come on. That's good defense right there. That's good defense. The final shot. No, come on, Brian Brown. Put him in a hook throw for a reason. Come on. Alright, you can see right here he's running man. It's gonna be just same old spinner. Looking either Y or Tank Joe. Or Tank Dell. There it is. Off to the races, man. AJ Terrell is getting cooked right now by the rookie Tank Dell. And we're up top to the end zone, man. Great dot, great drive. Two plays, one touchdown. Up, two touchdowns. Come on, baby. And their deficit a little wider than it was at halftime. Does that touchdown a minute ago change the thinking here at all? I think it does, at least a little. Wow. Marcus Williams gets close. I get made him up on the wrong way. Uh, and honestly, like the defense that he was there. Um, yeah, he just got close. Dug it. Happens all good. Eluding the pressure right. And he just getting in goal. Dug going to look to throw this. Oh gosh, I open. I guess I moved. <laughs> Dang, that's not bad. Bad defense, bro. Just bad defense all around. Keys time. Still enjoying the lead here in the third quarter, despite their defense giving up that last touchdown. Now we'll see if they can get the equalizer here on this drive. Here's Jackson. Running back. Thank you, JK. Great hands. Great hands. Need it that actually. All dots, all knocked out. Uh, right here, I think I'm gonna go flood. Try to throw it to the sideline, to the right. If you can get his toes out of bounds, it won't get knocked out. It's not even there. Gotta throw it though. <laughs> it's there, baby. Oh man, that's a great dot. There it is, JK. There it is, JK. You do not get caught. How does he get caught, bro? How is he that gas? Oh my gosh. I mean, I'll take I'll take the great game, but JK, we gotta get in the end zone, bro. What the hell? Now it's Chili Hurt. It's first and goal just outside the five. They'll run with Dobbins. Excuse me. Excuse me. Into the end zone. Come on, baby. Let's go. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. So remember, Charles, last time they were out here, they scored, but they just saw the opposition score, and they're trailing right now, so they're trying to keep pace here. They... Man, it's caught at the six-yard line. Mm -hmm. What? Goal, they got to be that was... a chance to get right back into this football game. Oh There's Duggan to throw. 
Bro, that was cover two man. Marcus Williams is terrible for that. What the hell? Thank you, Ted. Bro, Marcus Williams was actually in great position and got literally ran by. Literally ran by. That was crazy. Breakout game, man. I don't care if I'm running the ball over and over. When you have 6,000 KOs on your team, that's what I have to do, and I will do it. Bro. I will go up top as well. I will go up top as well, man. You celebrate it too early. Don't ever do that again. Don't ever celebrate too early ever again in your life. Lutzel looked to add the extra point. Oh, they flip it to the kicker. He looks like he's going to throw it. And it's caught inside the five. And From the midfield stripe, they'll look to throw. And he's going to be intercepted a third time. Oh. You gotta respect it, man. He has one read, and he's gonna throw it out one read for the right <laughs> Sorry, I finally adjusted to it. Took like the whole game, but you know, there it is right there, man. That's good defense. This game is over, man. I will see you guys in the post game. Alright, man. GG to so that guy. He did not want to quit for some reason. That game was over early, and he did not want to quit. Lamar was not great. I had some crazy stats that game. Plus one throw per for Lamar. I'm hoping we get a breakout next week, taking on the Chicago Bears, who are, da, 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 they're 0-2, but, you know, 0-2 doesn't really mean anything. Anybody in this league can be good. We'll give you a good game. I'll see you guys in part, part two of the bit. Guys, we got a breakout game for a linebacker. I have, oh, Jermaine Johnson. Brian Burns, interesting. All right, I was hoping this would be Jermaine Johnson because Brian Burns is already a superstar, but it's all good, man. Uh, we get a breakout for him. We're playing the Chicago Bears, who are off to an 0 and 2 start. Uh, let's go ahead and do upgrades. All right, man, not too many upgrades. Jermaine Johnson, though, does get one. I think he had like four sacks last week. He's having a good season so far. Um, let's go ahead and auto upgrade the rest of the team. Let's just hop into the game, guys. And tackled him for a loss. Looks like he manned up. Tank to oh, that down. Great. On second down, Jackson. The dot right there, you get more. If you just turn something, probably at um, the turf right there at the 46 yard line. Probably have my safety if I have to get to the safety. They'll throw on first down with Jackson. Yeah, I figured, figured I couldn't catch that. Um, there, I don't know if you guys can't tell, everybody in this the league bought abilities on their DVDs. Um, I haven't bought any abilities, the world so fire, my team is outmatched pretty much every single game, if you guys can't tell mind. already. They'll try and throw for it here. Wide open there, he's only, and we have space, two men to beat, two men to beat, come on, Kadarius, that's a great catch, great ground control right there, he like cross man from across the field. From the gun, it's Jackson. Oh, he's beautiful dot right there, man, 7-0, got kind of, hey, I was dying up on that drive, but he has so many KOs on offense, he got looked up on the ball probably a little bit this game. That's though, doesn't it? Have we ever run into a running back that had a great game the week before that didn't think that's just going to naturally continue? Just make sure you feed me the football. And wow. that's they're all I should have started the football. Put a backside day. Come on, okay. So run towards the backside day. All right, maybe I don't play the run so aggressively. Now now to throw it. It's a ball. All right. To begin this drive, a long drive last time out for this offense, Charles. If you remember, they started basically in the shadows of their own end zone. More adjustments there on the back end. Yeah, because offensively, we know that they're not going to be shy about throwing that football. 
There we go. Possession catch that. That's a good dive. Lamar Jackson picks that on the money. That's why we drafted him. That's complete to Tony. Your quarterback makes it very, very difficult for him in that situation. Here's Jackson. Wide open up the middle. I don't even know what the defense is playing. He's trying to get too fancy with the cross. He's um, a good guy, I thought he could run. Dobbins. I'll take my time. Really bad. So he's 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 definitely a stop. Should I have one last round? Al throwing on first down here. They swing that out wide to Jacobs. Yeah, and to the 35 before. Back to throw. How? Oh, that's a great dive. I can see him pick that over there. That's a great dive. I mean, gotta play that. Second and ten, Howell. Good dot. I thought the whole play plays. He didn't really play much over there, and that's the side of the field. That's his money play right there. Right there play. All right. I mean, not a big deal because we get ball right here to get seven. Uh, he does get ball out of half, so got to get seven. Zerline game, still a little more than a minute to go in the half. The question, can they put something together here, try to take that lead into intermission? I would have to think that would be the goal for sure. I don't think you sit on any. They'll run up the gut with Dobbins. Oof. This will be stopped about two to now. Mmm, I didn't throw it to a great shoulder there. It's open. It's incomplete. Get that dot. Okay. At this point, I think it's to go here in half number one. On second down, here's Jackson. And this would take it in on the right sideline, but there. not in the field. On trots the field goal unit, and wow, this is going to be a challenge here. I don't know if that's in. I hit it pretty much perfectly. Ah, that's good. money right there. Alright, man. Going up three, going in the half. It's not bad. Um, our defense is playing fine. We just got to catch picks when we actually hit our hands. Well, Charles, in that first half, we saw a fair amount of offense on both sides of the football. And now the team trailing here will start with it in the third quarter. He'll put that all together and come out with something really strong, I believe, to get things going here in the third quarter. He's able to really get this one the across the floor. Throwing here, Howell. Throw left side complete. That's Jake with one bit on that touch pass. And this has become one of those kind of in vogue plays. You know, kind of like the shuffle pass was a few years ago. This one what? never got off the ground, but you understand why a lot of teams are running it. Wow. Touchdown! Wow. I mean, TJ Hawkinson. Oh, yeah. 52. Now Jackson on first down. So many KOs going over. Third down right here. Got to this up. up incomplete. On third down, Jackson. Tank out. Oh, good animation. First tank out. Right. Right. Dobbins running out of the gun. Let's go, Jacob. Who's on the clock? Who's on the clock? I think he passed him. All right. Needed that. Needed that. All right. A little bit of luck. Needed that for sure. Right. First down right there. Here's how. This one comes this is, to tight end Hawkinson. Now he's going to get this. Yeah. The tight end in motion right. How he'll look to throw it. Thank you both. Oh, I've had enough of your garbage. Wow, he got it back with his own quarterback. I don't think I've ever seen that before. And how we'll throw it. Honestly, touchdown bears. Honestly, good round combo. Can't even be mad. Wrong way. Here's second and twelve. Now Jackson, eluding the pressure right. Oh, a heck of Another run here with Dobbins. Running right through. Two guys right there, two guys right there. 
pressures, hits on quarterbacks, all those things, hoping to increase that throughout the game. And here we are in the fourth quarter, and they got a big one. Yeah, it's such a close game, a very good one. Okay, okay. Jackson. He'll swing uh, this out to Dobbins. Nothing like that. Not good. They get through the football an inch and precious time. To now Jackson. Flushed out right. All right, we'll take the game. I think we kind of have to. Honestly, can't play it too safe. Um, I think so, Sean, right there. Three points left. Let's try to lock in and not give up those three points. Let's go. Second down. Here's how. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. Let's go, baby. Jeez, jeez. Great defense. I think he has the tight end right there for like 10 yards. And that 10 yards is probably field goal range. But he got nervous, he made the wrong read, and he finally catch an interception after dropping like two this game and missing out on the GG's. I'll see you guys in the post game. All right, man. GG to that guy. Did we get the breakout? I don't think so. Yeah. yeah damn, Brian. It's all good. You're still a superstar, bro. All right, guys. I mean, pretty good start to the season. 2-1 with no abilities bought. Uh, I'll take on the Jets next week who are 1-1. One one. I'll see you guys then.